Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on WW Personal Points. It's May, so it is time for my April favorites. I have so many, so many WW food favorites, like an entire basket full. I have beauty favorites for you as well. So many things I've been loving over the last month. I can't wait to share them with you. So if you're excited for a huge favorites video, give this one a big, huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, because I upload lots and lots of new videos every single week, and I do a favorites once a month. So make sure your bell's turned on so you never miss a future video. Check out the description box down below where I will link everything that I share with you today with the exception of the foods that you can find at your local grocery store. You'll also find nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories, highly recommend, and one-on-one -on -one coaching if you would like to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to all of my other favorite things, and of course my Facebook group. Come on over, join us there, are linked down in that description box. So without further ado, let's jump into all my April favorites. First, we're going to start with WW Foods, and like I mentioned, I have a lot of them. So my first food favorite is one that I've been literally loving, and these are the P3 Portable Protein Snack Packs. I buy these at Walmart. They're less than $2. They have several different kinds. This one's my favorite. It has chicken, Monterey Jack cheese, and cashews in it. It is 160 calories, and it has 10 grams of protein. So this is such a great snack, and like it says, it's portable. So whenever I'm out and about, or if I were in an, if I had to work in an office or was out seeing clients for real estate, this would be my go-to snack because it's packed with protein and it's really good. The meat's good, the cheese is good, and I love that they throw in some nuts, which is a healthy fat and an extra source of protein. So I absolutely love these and highly recommend. Next up are these particular Clio bars or this particular flavor. This is the Berry Acai Flavored Less Sugar Yogurt bar from Clio Snacks. Now I found this at Whole Foods. That's the only place that I found this particular flavor. This is the one that has one gram of sugar, seven grams of protein, and only 100 calories. So I love these for a dessert because I get in seven grams of protein, no sugar, and they taste really good. And this acai berry one, so good. It's so fresh and bright and berry forward. I really, really love this flavor. Next up from Imperfect Foods, you know I love Imperfect Foods. This is their tzatziki dip. Now I love tzatziki dip, any tzatziki dip, but I don't know what voodoo magic's in this one from Imperfect Foods, but it is so good. It has little tiny chunks of cucumber, so it gives that crunch factor when you're eating the dip. I love it with crackers, with pita bread. I love to put this on turkey burgers or hamburgers or add this as the condiment on a sandwich. It is so, so good. It's my favorite tzatziki dip I've ever tried. And again, this is from Imperfect Foods. It's their brand. I'll put Imperfect Foods down in the description box for you with $20 worth of free groceries. So $20 worth of free food, no minimum order. You can go ahead and grab Imperfect Foods if it's in your area. And don't forget to add their tzatziki dip. Speaking of dips, I also got this one from Imperfect Foods, but I know that you can find the Good Foods brand at most grocery stores. This is their Creamy Ranch Yogurt Dip so good. It's thick. It's ranchy, if that's a word. And I love to dip my vegetables in this. Carrots, cucumbers, mushrooms, bell peppers. It's so good. And I've also been known to use both of these as a condiment on the sandwich, on my sandwich. Less points, less calories, lots of flavor. The ranch one, 10 out of 10. Another favorite, as always, are my Verb Energy Bars. But this is a new product to the Verb Energy line. This is their variety pack. So in this particular bag, you get three different, really popular, really delicious Verb Energy Bars, five of each bar. They're 90 calories a piece and only, and only three points per bar. So in this variety pack, you get chocolate chip banana bread, vanilla latte, and cookie butter. All three of those flavors are delicious. This particular one is cookie butter, and this is the size of the bar. They are nice and chewy, so they're similar to a granola bar texture, but they're chewy and soft. They're really delicious. Three points, 90 calories, 65 milligrams of caffeine, which is the same as a shot of espresso. So it's a great pre-workout, post-workout, afternoon pick-me-up, 
really any time during the day. I always, always have one of these in my purse because they're so good and I love that little bit of a pick-me-up. I will link Verb Energy Bars down below for you. With that link, you get $10 off this pack, so it's only $15 for 15 bars plus with that link verb throws in six extra bars for you so you actually get almost another half of a bag for free when you purchase the sample pack the best pick-me-up bar ever from Trader Joe's this seasoning is a must have. It's always sunny in Arizona, but we're moving into spring and summer in most areas, in most countries, and this is the ideal rub or seasoning for the barbecue. We love this on hamburgers. Every time we cook a hamburger or a turkey burger or a chicken burger, this is my go-to seasoning. It says rub and seasoning with coffee and garlic. Now, my husband doesn't like coffee, and he doesn't think that this has a coffee taste to it, but I think the coffee in here just enhances all of the other flavors. It is a a seasonal product at Trader Joe's so I always buy at least two when it's out but it's a fantastic rub for barbecued food. Speaking of seasoning I'm obsessed with this one from McCormick Grillmates. This is the Smoky Applewood Marinade Mix. We use this to marinate the meat on our kebabs. This is so good on chicken. So good on chicken. It's one of my all-time favorite seasonings from Grillmates. I count this as zero points. It does have 10 calories per three-quarter teaspoon and it says that there's there's 11 servings in here. I think it would be zero points per serving anyways, but I do not count points for any seasonings, but this one is good on all meats. I've shared these bars quite a few times over on my Instagram. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll put it here for you. That's how you can keep up with me day to day. I post on there all the time, especially in my stories. And I've been sharing these Love Good Fats bars. I discovered these at Whole Foods and fell in love with them. I've purchased them at Sprouts. These have two grams of sugar, nine grams of protein, five net carbs. They're 190 calories per bar and they're so good. They're a coated bar and the inside of them is kind of a sandy texture, but not in a bad way. It's just kind of, it dissolves in your mouth a little bit. It's really hard to explain, but it's really good. And then there's chunks of flavor and cookie in there, which adds that nice crunch. They are really good and they keep me full. I use these mainly as a snack, but honestly, you could even use these as a meal replacement. They're delicious. I've tried several of the flavors and loved every single one of them. Next up is from Oikos, and this is their Oikos Pro Yogurt. This is their protein yogurt. It has 20 grams, two zero grams of protein per little container, and it's really good. It's thick, it's creamy. The flavors that they have all taste really good. The peach, my absolute favorite. I love adding some cereal or some granola to this for a crunch, and I absolutely love that it's 20 grams of protein. This is a great, great way to help you reach your protein goals. In a recent What I Eat in a Day, I shared this new True Fru find. I actually shared with you guys the chocolate covered banana. This is the coconut melts. These are so good. These are so delicious. I love the True Fruit brand in general. You know I've bought their frozen blueberries, strawberries, raspberries in the past and I love them. These, you can see that I found these at Ross for $4.99 a bag. The banana ones are delicious. These are also delicious. They have a creamy coconut center in this really good high quality milk chocolate. It's 150 calories per serving, which is a quarter of a cup. There are four servings in this little bag, so it's a really good amount. So good, so good, and the ingredients in True Fru are really, really high quality. So if you can find these, actually, if you find these anywhere besides Ross, let me know so that I can go buy them because I love them. Here's another product I've been loving and I picked this up from Imperfect Foods as well. This is from the brand Ancient Harvest and this is their quinoa with sea salt. These are pre-cooked little microwavable pouches it makes it so easy to make quinoa. If you've ever made quinoa from scratch, you know that it takes a while for it to get soft and fluffy. This is just really convenient. You rip it open about two inches, pop it in your microwave for 90 seconds, and you have perfect, perfect fluffy, delicious quinoa. They're affordable. The whole pouch is 430 calories. They say the pouch is at one serving, but I usually get at least two or three servings out of the little pouch. It's just really easy to make quinoa 
quinoa so healthy for you and this tastes delicious and again is from Imperfect Foods. So when you place your order and take advantage of your free $20, you can pick up all three of these goodies. These are another goodie that I've been sharing quite a bit in my meal preps and my what I eat in a days and these are the Reese's Zero Sugar. Now these are just the little mini Reese's peanut butter cups. Honestly, these taste exactly like the full sugar one. I don't notice any difference at all. You can have three of these for 110 calories. I usually have one as a dessert and it just satisfies that whole chocolate peanut butter craving. These are delicious. And like I said, to me, they don't taste any different than the regular Reese's peanut butter cups and you can save yourself points, calories, and sugar. And we're at the last of my huge list of WW food favorites and this is from the brand Milton's. These are their cheesy cheddar crackers. Now let me open these up so I can show you what the cracker looks like. So this is the size of the cracker. I would say it's just a hair bigger than a Cheez-It. There are five servings in this bag, 16 crackers per serving for 130 calories. These are delicious. These are better than Cheez-Its. They're light, they're crispy, and they're airy, and they have such a good cheese flavor. I love to dip these in this ranch dip. It's so good. These are good in hummus. These are good as a crunchy snack by themselves really delicious. So if you can find these, I found these at Fry's, which is a Kroger store, Fred Meyer. There's many, um, many stores under the Kroger umbrella, but that's where I found these. Even better, they're an organic cracker, so they're a higher quality. So good. That was a lot of WW food favorites, and I actually have some other new foods that I've been testing out, but I'll save them for the next favorites video because I want to make double, triple sure that they truly are a favorite. So now let's jump into my April beauty and skincare favorites. Perfume. You already know I love perfume. You know I love Dossier. Dossier is such a great brand. They replicate high-end fragrances for affordable prices. Their prices are $29 to $39 per bottle, rather than hundreds of dollars per bottle. The scent has a excellent lasting power and honestly, they are a dead on match to the high-end fragrances for a much, much more affordable price. So I decided to add two new Dossier fragrances to my collection in the month of April and I love both of them. So I wanted to share them with you. The packaging is so nice. These make great gifts for the perfume lover in your life. You always receive a card. It lets you know the name of the perfume, what high-end fragrance it replicates, the notes of it, and the bottles are so nice. I love the magnet lid. I love that so much because I can throw these in my purse and I don't ever have to worry about the lid coming off. So in April, I grabbed two new scents. First is the Amber Cherry. And this is inspired by Tom Ford Lost Cherry Odie Perfume. So the top notes in this one are cherry, almond, and cinnamon, which I love for spring and summer, that kind of fruity, spicy note. The middle notes are cloves, rose, jasmine, and plum. And the base notes are Peru, Balsam, Tonka Bean, and Vanilla. Oh, it's so yummy. I smell cherry. I smell almond. I smell vanilla. It has a very, very, very light balsam kind of musky scent to it. It smells so good. It's a gourmand sweet smell. And I've really been loving this one. This one stays all day and the few times I've worn this, I've received lots and lots of compliments and you can't beat the price of this versus the Tom Ford. And here's the second fragrance that I picked up at the beginning of April and this is the Citrus Green Apple. This is inspired by Dolce & Cabana Light Blue. Who doesn't love that scent? That takes me back to high school. I used to wear that scent all the time in high school and college and nothing's changed. I still absolutely love the scent. So the top notes on this one are green apple, lime, and cedrit. The middle notes are bluebell, jasmine, and rose, and the base notes are amber, cedarwood, and musk. Now this one is a little bit more musky, but it still has that fresh smell that you get from the Dolce & Gabbana light blue. I just love it. It is sweet. It is citrusy. It's got that base note of musk. It's just the perfect fragrance for spring or summer. It makes me want to wear it right now. It smells so delicious. I love that there's that little yumminess of the green apple. Such a great scent. This is another one that's a classic high-end fragrance for a more affordable price through Dossier and another one that lasts 
all day on the skin. So I will go ahead and link Dossier down below for you with a 10% discount and you can actually double dip your discount. So whatever sale is going on on the Dossier website, you can stack that 10% discount onto that. So you can get 20, 30, 40% off of Dossier fragrances. You already know I favorite dossier all the time. Starting with the Vitabread C Vitamin C Serum. This is the Wrinkle Serum. This is a fantastic product. I use this no more than a couple of days and notice it filled in a lot of the fine lines and wrinkles that I have under my eyes, on my forehead. I noticed results within a couple of days of this. This is a product that I use every single morning under my moisturizer and sunscreen. It is fantastic. I love skincare where I see immediate results and then long lasting results. I've been using this for well over half the month of April and it quickly became a favorite. This is another serum that I love. This is from the brand Dermalect and this is their self-esteem beauty sleep serum. This is my nighttime serum. What I love about this besides how great it works is it smells so delicious. It smells like maple, like pancake syrup. It smells really, really good. It sinks into the skin so quickly. And this is another one that within days I had visible results. I wake up in the morning and my skin looks amazing. It is plump and hydrated and it just looks glowy and fresh in the morning. I love this. You can see that I'm well over halfway done with this and I am buying this time and time again. This is my go-to night serum. It's incredible. I also have some makeup favorites, makeup products that I've been loving. Every single one of these is on my face today. Starting with the brand new product from NYX. This is their Wonder Stick. Now they came out with two different ones. One that's a highlighter and bronzer and this one is a blush and a contour. So this is a double ended stick product. You have one end that has a deeper shade and one end that has a lighter shade. So how you use this product is the deeper shade is going to go right where you would contour kind of in your cheekbone the lighter shade is used as a blush. You apply a stripe of both of them to the cheeks and blend it out and it gives you this beautifully contoured blush look to your cheeks. It's going to accentuate your cheekbones, add some contouring, and then add this beautiful flush of color for blush. This product is great. Now I haven't ordered the bronzer and highlighter, but now that I know that I love this one so much, I'm gonna order the bronzer highlighter stick as well. I'll link actually both of them down below for you. This has been my favorite eyebrow pencil for the last month or so, and this is again the one that I use today. This is the Juvia's Place eyebrow pencil. One end of it is your eyebrow pencil, the other end is a spoolie. This eyebrow pencil works really well. It is a fine enough tip that you can add those nice brush-like strokes to your brows. It fills in any sparse areas and it looks natural. And it's really affordable because it's Juvia's Place. I've used a lot of brow products and this one for the price is the best that I've ever used. It's become a staple and a go-to for me. Another newer product that I've been loving comes from Ofra Cosmetics and this is their liquid highlighter. This is the highlight that I have on my cheeks today. I love this product, I love it. It comes in a pump top, so I just pump a couple of small dots on my hand, blend it out with a beauty blender, and it adds this really pretty natural glow. What's great about a liquid highlighter is it doesn't sit on the skin, it sinks into the skin. So you have that really pretty glow from within look, this is also a great product to mix in with your foundation if you want an all over glow to the face. I love it. They came out with several shades. I grabbed the lightest shade only because I wanted to use it as highlighter and as a mix into my foundation. It's beautiful. I mean, beautiful. My lips today is the brand new lip oil from Lunar Beauty. I'm obsessed with these lip oils. I need more. I need more. He came out with three lip oils and I love every single one of them. They have scents like watermelon and strawberry, but what's great about these lip oils is they don't feel greasy on the lips. It doesn't feel like you spread melted butter on your lips, but it still gives you that beautiful glimmering shine like melted butter, but it's just a really great formula. And what's even better besides the scent and the formula is the longevity. Lip oils generally come off rather quickly, not these Lunar Beauty ones. They will last on my lips for hours and hours. I'm obsessed with them. I purchased all three of the ones that were recently released. If you want to try lip oil or you are a lip oil connoisseur like myself, these are going to be your new go-to. And last but not least is the setting spray that I've been loving. This again is the setting spray that I use today. This is a drugstore brand, 
This is the drugstore setting spray from the brand Milani. This is their Make It Last, but this one has SPF 30. So it has sunscreen built into the setting spray. You know, I mentioned that I put sunscreen on my face every single morning because especially in Arizona, I'm in the sun every day and I want to protect my skin, but adding this as my setting spray just gives me that little bit of extra SPF protection. And besides that, this dries instantly. It does not make your face wet at all. You spray it and your face is dry. No need to fan or anything. I love it. It literally dries instantly and it has such a light mist that it's very pleasant to apply to the skin and I love it. It has a really fresh scent and I just love that it dries fast and has SPF 30. And as always, we're going to end out my beauty favorites with my favorite palette of the month and it's this little cutie right here. This is the number six palette from Fenty Beauty. She's beautiful. She is a cool toned neutral dream. You guys know I love color. I love color for eyeshadow, but every once in a while I love a good cool tone and I love a good neutral and this little Fenty Beauty palette really, really surprised me. I have used every shade in this palette. The mattes blend beautifully. The shimmers are beautiful and sparkly. I really, really love this. I've worn this more times than I can count. And that says a lot because I have well over 200 eyeshadow palettes. So if I'm reaching for this little guy right here, you know it's become a quick favorite. I think I wore this at least six times in the month of April. It's such an easy to use neutral palette. I love every look I've ever created with it. And because it's a smaller six pan palette, it makes it easy to decide what shades to put on your eyes. So highly recommend. Fenty Beauty has a lot of these little palettes. They all have different numbers, but this is the Snap Shadow in the number six, and I love it. So those are all of my April favorites. Lots and lots of WW foods, beauty, skincare, all the things that I've been loving in the month of April. Don't forget that I'll have everything linked down below for you, as well as nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my other favorite things, and my Facebook group. Definitely come on over and join us there as well. We'd love to have you. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know down in the comments if any of my favorites are your favorites, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.